I'm sorry, boss. I'm happy for the fans and for the players. Would you say at half time to get that response to them? It was a very impressive second half after a pre court first half. I think you will know what I told. If you want to know, you will know. You know everything. You know what is true, you know what is not true. I'm pretty sure that you will you will make some some calls and you will know what uh, we spoke at half time. Joseph, do you think anyone doubting your fight or your, your team's fight, you know, what's that final 20 minutes? You know, I think... Uh, <laughs> there is too much talk and you put in doubt the honesty and the professionalism of, uh, of the players. One thing is uh, you can't do better and another thing is you don't want to do better and another thing is you can do better but you don't cope well with the feelings surrounding the, um, your environment. But um, I think the players they showed they wanted to win the match. Jose, how impressed were you with, uh, with Pogba in the second half as a, as a centre back? Is that as good as he played for you? He didn't play centre back. Where, where was he in the second half? He was playing with Matic in front of, uh, of Smalling because we need some technical quality to bring the ball from the back and the way to have some technical quality to bring the ball from the back was to play Pogba and not teach there. Jose, we've seen a few times in the last few days you seem to make a gesture with your pinky finger. Can you tell us what that, what that means? Is, is a finger. You seem, you seem to make a sort of pointed gesture with it. it no, it's a mean anything? No, it's a finger. Uh, smaller than the others. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it's a finger. Still, it's not going to stop just because of one win. What, what stops it? Just a succession of wins? Or? It doesn't stop. Nothing will stop it? No, I don't think so. Josie, what did you think of the fans singing your name today? I'm amazed. I'm amazed by that. I'm amazed by that. I don't want that. If I could, if I could tell them, please don't do it, I would, I would say that. I, I think this is not about me, this is about the, the football club, this is about the club they love and this is about the club we represent with um, all the honour and all the dignity. But I'm, I'm amazed by that. Um, at half time we were losing 2-0 and um, the fans were magnificent to the team. I, I don't speak to me, to the team. And that's that's fantastic. Uh, I used to say in in my football memories, I used to say that one day I beat Liverpool in Anfield 4-0. Uh, I think it was 4-0. And, and I was amazed with the stadium singing Liverpool song. I was amazed and full of respect by, by that. But now I am in a, in a situation where uh, I'm losing 2-0 at home uh, in a match that everybody knows that was very important for us to win. And the fans, they were uh, absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. I'm, I'm really, really grateful for, uh, for that and my happiness about the victory is not is not 
because of myself, is because of uh, the fans that uh, and the players. The fans and the players, they can go to the national team with a good feeling and the fans, they can go home with a feeling of uh, victory. Okay, last Alexis. question. Big goal for Alexis's confidence, Jose, as well as obviously the team. I think he's a good boy, he's a, he's a good professional, works really hard. Um, not playing especially well in, in, uh, in some periods. Um, also, when the team doesn't play especially well, it's difficult for players individually to, to perform especially well. But today, I think it's an amazing feeling for him to score a, a winning goal in a, in a comeback that is, uh, you know, it's, it's nice. It's, it's a very nice, a very nice comeback. Okay, guys, thank you. Thank you.